Kensington Palace has announced the release of an official portrait of Kate surrounded by her offspring. This morning, she expressed gratitude to the public for their unwavering support and unveiled a fresh photograph with her children, captured in honor of Mother's Day. At last, the press service of the House of Wales heeded the numerous recommendations of royal analysts on how to quell public unrest linked to the uncertainty of the Princess of Wales' condition. Kensington residents presented a previously unpublished photograph where Kate and her three children pose on the threshold of their abode, and, according to statements, the frame was captured by William himself this year. There is no convincing evidence that the image of Kate is current, nor is the date of its creation specified. Questions are raised by the green lawn and foliage on the trees. Catherine's visage appears the same as before her ailment, and bears little resemblance to the lady captured by TNZ photographers on March 5. Nevertheless, the possibilities of Photoshop have not been ruled out, and rightly so. This frame was dedicated to the celebration of Mother's Day, and the publication was signed with the initial letter of Kate's name, C. It is worth noting that in the presented photograph of Kate Middleton, in the company of her three hairs, it is difficult to say who is smiling more joyously. Each of her offspring delights with a broad smile, creating the impression that the saga, which held us in suspense at our screens for many long weeks, or even months, has concluded. We begin to realize that the British royal family may have been misleading us or trying to conceal the real location and true state of health of Prince William's spouse. The information we possess was disseminated by Kensington residents, that is, an official source. According to some media outlets, particularly GB News anchor Cameron Walker, this photograph was taken by Prince William at the beginning of this week, which ends today, Sunday, March 10. However, doubts and suspicions are intensifying that the photograph could have been created using artificial intelligence, sparking heated discussions on social media. For me personally, the starting point was the opinion of one social media user. How is it possible that the photograph, which, according to the British press, was taken at the beginning of the week, that is, on Monday, and the time difference between these events is almost a day? How we transitioned, according to this user, from the first photograph, where we see Kate Middleton, if it is indeed her, as many speculate that it could be Pippa Middleton, and I'm usually skeptical of such theories, but this time it really creates the impression that she more closely resembles Kate's younger sister than the Princess of Wales herself, to the second photograph, where everything becomes clear. We see a swollen face on Monday and a photograph, likely taken no later than Tuesday, on which she looks as usual. Concerns have been raised regarding the excessive slenderness of the Princess of Wales. The delicate limbs we observe are a source of worry. However, in social media, it's not so much Kate Middleton's posture that captures attention, but rather the peculiarities of her offspring's appearance. For instance, the limb of the eldest hair, George, appears unusually disproportionate. The extremely small right hand, in comparison to the significantly larger left, also draws the eye to the positioning of the younger child's right hand. All this creates an odd impression in this image, and many claim that the social media public will always find a reason for dissatisfaction. Personally, I believe that most theories spread on social networks are not trustworthy, as absurdity is often encountered there. Yet, some users attempt to present evidence, like this individual on the screen, who has passed an artificial intelligence verification check. According to the site's analysis and the alleged clues provided by this person, there is a 75%, nearly 76% probability that this photo was generated using artificial intelligence. In the comments, followers expressed hope for Kate's swift recovery and noted her radiant appearance. Happy to see the princess surrounded by family, they remark. In the photo, Kate is captured sitting in a chair, dressed in a dark blazer, slim blue jeans, and ankle boots. Her hair was freely flowing, and her face bore her usual makeup. The children surrounded their mother, and judging by the photograph, all of them are laughing joyously, which should convince the public of the family's well-being and the absence of reasons for concern. 
a very sensible step to put an end to the various conjectures about Kate's condition, although modern technologies allow any scene to be recreated. If it weren't for the prolonged period of recovery, one might assume that all was well with Kate, but the fact that the princess has no plans to participate in public events in the near future indicates ongoing recovery. All this looks quite mysterious, and that's not all. Some have even doubted the authenticity of the photo and the timing of the shot, pointing to a discrepancy between the greenery and the presumed weather with what was observed in England, specifically in Windsor, Adelaide, and Cotter last week. But there's more. Particular attention deserves the snapshot of Kate Nilton's right hand, which seemingly embraces the waist of her younger child and strangely blurs around his waist. Blurred fingers and an unusual fold in her upper garment are noticeable. Some claim that the pattern on her garment disappears in the photograph, but the depth to which it recedes inward is unusual for such images. It gives the impression that another, more voluminous hand was embracing this waist, pressing the garment more firmly, and now has been replaced with the more graceful hand of Kate Middleton. And that's not all, as many are confident that all is well, but Kate Middleton undoubtedly appeared without a wedding ring, without an engagement ring, and without anything that could link her to Prince William, her husband. All this occurs against the backdrop of numerous rumors that Kate Middleton wishes to divorce, or has even already requested a divorce from her husband. I have refrained from addressing this topic in my videos due to a lack of credible evidence. However, recent discussions on social media suggest that Kate Middleton's disappearance could be linked to her potential intention to propose a divorce to William. This speculation threatens the traditional view of the monarchy, as a king without a consort is perceived as not fully embodying his role, according to opinions prevalent among internet users, particularly in Britain. In light of these rumors, the phrase never complain and never explain, mentioned by Harry in his autobiography, comes to mind, seemingly alluding to the unspoken code of the royal family to not air their grievances or justify their actions publicly. Yet, recent events indicate the contrary. The royal family does respond to public sentiment, as evidenced by press releases. Specifically, William, through his spokesperson, stated, Social media rumors do not concern me. I am focused on my duties. However, a photograph disseminated by TMZ suggests otherwise. The royal family closely monitors the media landscape and reacts to circulating rumors. Following abdominal surgery, Kate Middleton temporarily withdrew from public life, and the royal family did not comment on her condition, causing concern among the British public. A snapshot of the Princess of Wales behind the wheel only fueled interest in her health. Today, Kate Middleton is hailed as the future queen, though the throne will pass to her husband, Prince William. Despite this, she already holds the titles of Her Royal Highness and Princess of Wales. Kate, hailing from an ordinary English family, has fulfilled the dreams of many by marrying a prince, thanks to her qualities and efforts. In response to the rumors, Gullen remarked that he does not give credence to idle chatter on social networks, dismissing them as insignificant. This demonstrates that, despite their proclaimed motto, the royal family is not indifferent to public opinion and is prepared to defend its stance, unlike the British media, which, as loyal servants, follow the monarchy's directives. Consequently, no grievances are aired, no formal claims are pressed in the media, and the photograph in question seems to mirror the tension that has been palpable on social networks for an extended period. The existence of tension is undeniable, yet the manner of its manifestation astonishes me. It was said that even those close to William asserted he would never yield to the dictates of the tabloids or British mass media, that if the Daily Mail summoned him, it would be the last thing he would do. It appears as though William was impervious to pressure or threats, but reality suggests otherwise. Most enigmatic is that this portrait, as I've mentioned before, has spawned a multitude of doubts, particularly due to the absence of a wedding ring, leading many to question its authenticity. They note that Kate Middleton is depicted alone, that the hands in the photo do not belong to her, and that perhaps the ring was forgotten or the children do not seem happy beside her. In any case, 
The main point for me, setting aside doubts and focusing on the facts is as I have already described. The wedding ring is missing, and all this, as I have noted, occurs against the backdrop of rumors of an emotional crisis between Kate and William, perhaps the most serious throughout their relationship, and the manner in which the media, in this case the palaces, specifically Kensington Palace, which seem to have never spoken out, and for me, as I said at the beginning of the video, how we could transition from this photograph by the American media to this photograph by the media or, in this case, the official source of Kensington Palace on social networks. Who is Kate Middleton on social networks? Who is she not? Is this a new photograph of Kate Middleton? I see Kate Middleton and assert, if we do not seek anything unusual in this image, she looks very slender, which perhaps confirms theories and comments, for example, by Camilla's biographer, Angela Levin, about mental health issues. Other media in the USA have mentioned eating disorders, including bulimia. We do not know what is truly happening, but some facts are evident. Millions observe as William succumbs to pressure, and this cannot be denied, and most astonishing is that no lady appears without her wedding ring. I await your opinions. How do you perceive this photo? Is it the result of artificial intelligence's work? And especially, how do you think? Why is the Princess of Wales shown in such an unusual manner without any confirmation of her attachment?